What's going on guys, Billy here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to calibrate the IMU on your DJI Mavic Air. For those wondering, the IMU is the inertial measurement unit. It is a single electronical unit that houses two different sensors. The first is the accelerometer triad, which ultimately deals with the acceleration of your drone, and the second is the angular rate triad, which detects changes in rotational attributes such as pitch, roll, and yaw. If that explanation went over your head, the IMU essentially compiles information and data to keep the drone and balanced during flight. Now, as far as when you want to perform an IMU calibration, the first time should be as soon as you take it out of the box, or at least before your first flight, as your drone has been transported from China from DJI's manufacturing facility on an airplane, and it could have messed up that initial calibration. Another time you'll want to perform an IMU calibration is if you notice any small errors during flight. So, for example, if you're trying to fly your drone straight forward, but it seems to be flying or veering off to the side, and that isn't due to the wind, an IMU calibration could fix that up. Also, if you're just trying to hover the drone, if you take off and it sits there for a couple seconds and you notice it drifting from side to side, again, an IMU calibration should be able to fix that right up. The final time I would recommend calibrating your IMU is after a crash. Even if it's just a small bump, it's always better to be safe than sorry and calibrate your IMU. One thing that you don't need to do is calibrate your IMU before every single flight. I know some people say that they like to do so, but I find it to be a waste of time because this process is pretty time consuming and also you're going to need a perfectly level flat surface. So if you're out flying in, let's say, a field, you're not going to be able to find that level surface while you're out there. Speaking of which, let's go over now how to calibrate the IMU of your DJI Mavic Air. The first thing that we need to do is make sure we have a level surface. I like to use this level app on my iPhone to be sure that the surface I'm using isn't off balance. Next, we need to prep the drone for the calibration by removing the propellers to make things easier, removing the gimbal guard so we don't stress the motor of the gimbal, and then turning on both the Mavic Air and the remote. To begin our IMU calibration, simply tap the three dots in the top right corner, go to the main controller settings, swipe down to advanced settings, scroll down to the middle of the page, and select sensors. Once you're here, tap on calibration. Calibrate IMU. Once you're all set up and ready to go, click on start and follow along with the pictures that are provided on the screen. Stand by as the pictures cycle through or follow along with me as I calibrate the IMU on my Mavic Air. So guys, there we have it. That is how to calibrate the IMU on the Mavic Air. It's a little bit different depending on which DJI drone that you have. So for example, when you go to calibrate the IMU on the Mavic Pro, it actually instructs you to fold up all the legs and then from there flip it on each of its sides as you go through the calibration. Now this won't fix every single little problem that your drone has, but if you do have a problem down the road and you go to DJI support, they're often going to tell you to calibrate the IMU first and see if that fixes it. So doing this will save you some time as you go through that process. But guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, and as always, I'll talk to you later. Peace.